Hello, my name is Dr. Diwan S. Raja. Today I will discuss about multiple choice questions in lower limb anatomy from question number 81 to 100. I will put the answer keys as well as the Amazon link of two of my books in the description of this video. Let us start the multiple choice questions. Question number 81 to 84 requires matching nerve supply of the muscles at the mid thigh region transverse section with the alphabets indicated here. 81 D. This is the muscle vastus lateralis innervated by the femoral nerve. 82 Tibial part of sciatic nerve. A. This is the semi tendinosus muscle. Semi tendinosus muscle is here. Nerve supply by the tibial part of sciatic nerve. Nerve for the hamstring muscle. So the semi tendinosus is the hamstring muscle supplied by the tibial part of sciatic nerve. Then C. Here is the C. It has dual innervation. This muscle. This is the a doctor a doctor magnus to nerve supply tibial part of sciatic nerve and obturator nerve the posterior division question number 84 b b is the a doctor longus nerve supply by the obturator nerve okay we got that okay here the multiple choice questions okay so we have gone through that part okay so we have just discussed that part let's go to this part here question number 85 to 87 requires matching nerve supply of the muscles beneath the inguinal ligament this is the inguinal ligament we have muscles here the iliacus psoas major pectineus Okay, branches from the root of spinal nerve L2, L3, and sometimes L4. That is the nerve for the psoas major. B is the answer. Okay, here B is the answer. Okay, here the B is the answer. This is the nerve, sub this is psoas major. It gets nerve supply branches from the roots of the spinal nerve L2, L3, and sometimes L4 the lumbar plexus okay question number 86 branches from the femoral nerve okay supply switch muscle this is the iliacus muscle okay by supplied by the branches from femoral nerve question number 87 femoral nerve and obturator nerve okay dual nerve supply this is the pectineus a has dual nerve supply as because it is a doctor its innervation it is a it is an adductor muscle so it's innervation by the obturator nerve it is also a bit front so it is also getting innervation from the femoral nerve so the muscle here pectineus has dual innervation obturator part for the for the adductor group of muscle and uh, the muscles of the front of the thigh that is innervate that is also the extensor and that is innervated by the femoral nerve so this is femoral nerve nerve supply also obturator nerve is nerve supply even sometimes it may get accessory obturator nerve okay so we actually we actually accept it with dual nerve supply femoral nerve and the obturator nerve answer should be a here okay that is b that is C. Question number 88 to 90 requires matching ligaments on the left with the alphabets in the image. Iliolumbar ligament. Ilium to the lumbar. This is the iliolumbar ligament. That is C. Sacrotiburous ligament. From sacrum to the ischial tuberosity, this is the ischial tuberosity from sacrum. So this is the ligament here. The this is the this is the ligament. This is the sacrospinous ligament here. 
this is the ilio lamba leg take it easy okay so here is the ilio lamba ligament c okay then sacrospinous ligament is a from the sacrum to the spine sacrotuberous ligament from sacrum to the ischial tuberosity is a sacrotuberous ligament sacrospinous ligament ilio lumbar ligament okay then we'll go question number 91 to 95 requires identification of muscles with the alphabets in the image okay gluteus minimus what is the gluteus minimus b is the gluteus minimus gluteus medius is the muscle here c muscle okay gluteus maximus is here muscle has been cut this is the gluteus maximus okay this is the muscle then number 94 piriformis muscle this is the piriformis muscle a doctor magnus is this big muscle a doctor magnus okay we got the 95 we have reached we'll go next 96 to 100 identify bony attachment of the muscles with the alphabets in the image a doctor magnus this is the is insertion here okay it is a lot of medical legal importance then epiphysis at this level at this level okay so we'll go semi membranosus where does it inserts here is the site of insertion site of insertion of what the semi membranosus adductor magnus is where is the adductor magnus semi membranosus is d here okay then we'll go to the okay biceps femoris inserts where to the head of the fibula around the fibular collateral ligament this is the biceps femoris okay now we'll go there here is the popliteus muscle and plantaris this is the site for the popliteus muscle insertion here and plantaris will get the plantaris here origin here origin of plantaris that is in the lower part of the lateral supracondylar ridge ridge area of the femur here okay so we got all the questions and that's all about question number 81 to 100 if you have any question please feel free to ask me please share the information with your friends please support my channel please subscribe me and for your kind interest you may visit the answer keys in the description as well as name of the two book with amazon link so if you like you may collect them have a nice day bye now